Hello everyone, welcome back to my exam B. You may subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so that you do not miss updates on our upcoming videos. And in this series of 50 days, 50 questions for RBI DEPF phase one, we are here on day 11. I hope you have watched the previous videos and have solved the questions. And if you have any queries, you can always comment and ask in the chat box also related to any question, anything you may also call up on this uh, number if you like. So let's start with day 11 question. Here the question on your screen is six identical fair dice are thrown independently. Let S denote the number of dice showing even numbers on their upper faces. Then the variance of the random variable S is one. Now options here are given half one, three by two, three and four. You have to find what exactly is the variance of this kind of illustration. So firstly, you will have to see what kind of you know probability distribution I'm talking about. Then only you can apply the formula for the variance okay so different probability distributions have different uh, ways of calculating the variance you have different formulas for calculating the variance. so first let's find out what kind of distribution is it now we know six identical fair dice are thrown so n is equal to six right there are six dice that are thrown independently okay so independently this word is also important here all of these dice are thrown independently and there's an event which says that the number that appears on the upper face of the dice is an even number. So we know that there are six numbers that can appear in a die, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. And out of this, there are four which are even. So the probability of getting an even number would be half. That is three by six, which is half, right? So probability of getting a success, that is an even number is half, right? And the remaining other rest of the probability will be the probability of failure. Now, you can clearly guess such kind of distribution is a binomial distribution. Okay, where the probability of success and the uh, failure sum to one, right? And the trials are independent. That is also seen here, right? There are in independent trials that are made. So we can clearly figure out this, this is a binomial distribution. Now, why, how do you find out the variance for binomial distribution? Variance is given by n, p, q. This is the variance for binomial distribution. What p is the probability of success and q is the probability of failure, which is one minus p, which is also going to be half here. So now you have n, you have p, you have q. We can simply find out the value of variance. So this is going to be six times half times half which is going to be equal to 3 by 2 so hence your right answer is option c which is 3 by 2 here in this case okay i hope you have understood this question now in the same question let's say it was asked to find out the mean of the random variable s how will you find out the mean Reply in the comments, what do you think would be the value of mean for this distribution? For more such questions, attempt the mock test and watch this playlist. I hope your preparation is going well. If you have any other queries, call upon this number or email here.